I started learning Yiddish as kind of a pandemic whim. And I had no idea what I was getting myself into. I like learning languages, so it, I thought it would be something that was just kind of fun. But I had no idea how intermixed the language and the culture and the religion and the history just were all together. And I had no idea what an evocative language Yiddish was. I just got hooked. It's my fourth summer here, and being in person is amazing. Just learning with other students, especially with the young students. I really like that there's a mix of different age students. The energy level is really exciting. But just people from different countries bringing their own cultural experiences, um, people who are Jewish, people who are not Jewish, people who are sort of more more from, more religious, people who are not, you know, people who are very, very secular, people come to this from all different backgrounds. We've been hanging out together after class too, which is really fun. It's been fun to explore New York together a little bit. At this point, I, I am really strongly interested in translation. When you can read something in the original and understand what it is that these people were trying to convey, tie it into a story about my own family and realize that they had the same kind of experience. Um, that's just magical. I, I can't imagine a better way to learn Yiddish now because I, th I think this is as close as you can get to a full immersive experience and that just doesn't really exist anywhere else. It's definitely a marathon. You don't want to sprint early on. Um, but it's, it's just an amazing experience and I, I think that the students who come to learn Yiddish really want to learn. It's not like a learning experience in college or, you know, something where you have to do something. Everybody is there because they want to be there and there's just this mutual support among the students that's amazing. And it's just this wonderful environment. I just couldn't recommend it more.